Wii Fit. And uh, then he was really happy that Numbers was playing Wii Fit because, oh, yes. Oh, the music. My memes have come true. I feel like John picked this, at the very least, picked this track on the stage, right? The Why stage and song is 100% Numbers. Yeah, so, uh, but Benny could have mixed this. He could have said, no, we have to play on Battlefield with, like, not the, the dopest track in the game. <laughs> anyway, there's... Ooh! <laughs> that was... Oh, yo, my... Last time they played, that actually happened three times, I think. Numbers has to remember that Vinia can counter his soccer ball while he's on stage and spike him at off stage, killing him at what is might as well just be zero. So that is one of John's favorite, uh, just, you know, defensive tools. You know, just throw out this move so that people can't really mess with you. Uh, but yeah, that's not something he can get away with for free. That, just, you got to admit that 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 loops is so cool. I mean, this man, he was the best Wii Fit in the world back in Smash 4. I'm, is he the best Wii Fit in Ultimate yet? Who plays Wii Fit? I don't know, but Zach. there's... Well, no, there's going to be some guy yeah. out in, like... I don't know. West Virginia. <laughs> who, uh... Who get mad at me for saying it. It's like, oh, he doesn't even play this character. He's just an inkling main on vacation. But no, that is not the case with numbers here. As you can see, his abilities with this character are so strong, so po so potent. Now, quick question. What is the record between Venia and Mr. Eben lately? I'm not super sure. Um, yeah, I'm not really sure. I know that... Oh, that yeah. trade is not going to work out for numbers right there. But he comes down and immediately can start going for the uh, the deep breathing again. One F tilt from pretty much anywhere on stage will probably do it at this point. Oh, I think he wanted it. At least he went for some type of aggressive option, but then he can just be so hard to knock down. Right there, the back air is actually what's going to do it for him. Do it, 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 do it. <laughs> that was the game? That was the last stock? I'm, I'm not even sure what to think. I mean, that was a fantastic edge guard from Venia, for sure. But, wait, what even led him to that? How did he end up down there? Oh, right, yeah, he went to charge his deep breathing and then hit him with the what? <laughs> so... In a little bit of numbers fashion, he kind of lost the game to himself right there. Three, two, one, go! All right, but game two actually going to be on PS2. Uh, but regardless, in terms of preventing Venia from getting a three key, this is going to be, Numbers is one of his biggest obstacles, I think. Just based on the way that their sets have gone lately, where Numbers has been improving pretty rapidly with this character and getting closer and closer to that really big win. Uh, I mean, I think, I'm not sure if he's beaten that with Wii Fit yet. But as you can see, his, his aptitude with this character is second to none. No! It happened again! Is he dead? Oh, down there, just not able to reach enough to uh, get Greninja on his low hang. Great conversion right there from Venia. Wow. You know, I really have to commend the recoveries on from Vinny and the angles that he's choosing on his up B. In general, able to avoid most of those really big hits. Right there, kind of overextends. Uh, went for that down air as the aggressive option and kind of paid for it. John, that's how you lost game one. Why would you? Oh, man. 
Look at all of this damage. Neutral air after neutral air. Actually able to punish the down air, though. Wow, and that down smash putting him at a horrible angle. This could be it. But I love the high recovery from Penny. That's something that he's been going for again and again. But if Numbers prepares for that, I'm curious what his exact uh, punish for it would be. Oh, he was still in the animation for the uh, down B, so he got the Phantom Footstool. But then he actually went for that, which is pretty cute. That forward is pretty big. Numbers no longer has deep breathing to help him out with his survivability. Makes it back to the ledge. Wow, actually able to make that soccer ball connect. Oh, wow. He's alive. He hit him back with the soccer ball. All right, but yeah, no way he's going to be surviving that back here, that close to the black zone. Completely even game. And this isn't even like last time where it was even and then numbers just sort of went to die. It's just like, I've got to go real quick. These guys are going back and forth. And I sincerely think that if Numbers manages to take this game right here, he has a serious contention of winning the set. The way he's been playing since game one has been really solid. But the question is whether he can actually close out this game, considering the fact that Vinny is a master of adaptation himself. Oh, that's big. That up smash is not enough to do it quite yet, but... I think a deep breathing might be in order here. Or maybe John is trying to save it for when, you know, those deep breathing options will actually kill. I don't know, man. I feel like if you were to just, like, go Falcon, he'd, like, kill him on accident. But no. <laughs> All right. So, many are going to be moving on into winner's finals. Knox numbers into losers with the 2-0. And that means that Benny is one step closer to getting that big old three-peat.